It's Weekend Update with Colin Jost and Michael Chang. I'm Michael Che. I'm Colin Jost. Well, just like me when I'm drunk, Congress decided to spend a bunch of money at 2.30 in the morning. <laughs> they passed a $1.9 trillion stimulus bill, and Republicans are calling it a liberal wish list. But I don't know, I think a liberal wish list would be avocado toast with Chrissy Teigen, <laughs> free college for pets, and a hip-hop musical about Anderson Cooper starring Lin-Manuel Miranda. <laughs> Senator Lindsey Graham said he's very pleased that the bill will not include an increase to the minimum wage, because over the years, Graham has actually grown to love the taste of fast food worker spit. <laughs> Senator, Senator John Thune said he opposed the $15 minimum wage because he used to get by on six bucks an hour as a young man. But that was like 40 years ago when rent was like a dollar and everybody had one porno tape. See, this is why Democrats never get stuff done. You keep leaving it to a vote and taking no for an answer. When Republicans lose a vote, they storm the Capitol. Why can't y'all get that mad? Say what you will about a guy in a Viking helmet taking a dump in Nancy Pelosi's desk, but he will not be ignored. <laughs> Tomorrow night, Donald Trump will give the keynote address at the Conservative Political Action Conference for a preview of Trump's speech, Give Your Grandpa Cocaine. <laughs> Senator Ted Cruz, who's always the kill in F. Mary Kill, <laughs> taped, he taped his half-hour special at the CPAC this week. Here's just a sample of his killer set. I gotta say, Orlando is awesome. It's not as nice as Cancun. Yeah, no, stop. You don't do that. No, you are not in on the joke. It is not for you to enjoy. Also, what grown man yells Orlando is awesome? If you hear a grown man yell Orlando is awesome, you should probably check his hard drive. The Biden administration is hoping to persuade more black people to get vaccinated by setting up vaccination sites in churches. And I'm sure Biden means well, but that is such an old white guy idea. <laughs> you know that idea started with the words, hey, you know what those people love? <laughs> during, during the Golden Globes this Sunday, a new commercial will air that will be the first to ever show lactating breasts on television. Unfortunately, those breasts belong to the green M&M. <laughs> the FDA has authorized a vaccine from New Jersey-based company Johnson & Johnson. Johnson & Johnson will now pair the vaccine with needles from New Jersey's number one syringe supplier, The Beach. 